Okay, um, we are still in session 7 of um, linear functions and gamitin lang natin yung examples on how to write linear functions by using the ordered pairs or the table of values. So for number 1, we have um, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 as values of x and the values of y are 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So let's look at the relationship of x and y. Okay. Tignan natin yung relationship ng x and y. Diba, kung mapapansin nyo, diba, zero tayo nagsimula. Tapos, yung y, yan, yan okay. So, yung y, naging 2. So, kung ang x mo ay 0 at y mo ay 2, anong pwede natin gawin kay 0 para maging 2? So, it's possible na mag-add tayo ng, ng 2. Okay? Pa paano yung pangalawa? Y then x. Ang x mo ay 1. Tapos, ang y mo ay 3. Ano yung pwede mong gawin kay 1? Kasi hindi tayo pwedeng maggalaw ng y eh. Kasi yung y, that is the output. Ibig sabihin, kung ano lang yung nangyayari sa x, dumedepende lang yung magiging value ng y doon. Okay? So, ang gagalawin lang natin ay yung right side ng ating function. So, kung ang value ng y ay 3, ano kaya pwede natin gawin kay 1 para maging 3? So, sa unang, ng, sa unang um, solution, nag-add tayo ng 2. So, it is also possible that we, na mag-add tayo ng 2. Pwede tayo mag-add ng 2. Next, kung halimbawa ay, let's erase the graph. Erase ko na to. So, kung halimbawa, uh, ato naman, 3 na tayo. So, if x is 3, and the value of y is 5. Ano pwede natin gawin kay 3 para maging 5? So, kung napapansin nyo, ang trend, ang parang nagiging pattern, ay nag add tayo ng 2 sa x para, para makuha yung value ng y. So, kung halimbawa, ang value ng x ay 6. Okay? So, if the value of x is 6, anong gagawin natin? Para makuha yung value ng y, mag a tayo ng 2. Therefore, y is equal to 8. And, kung mapapansin, if we're going to subtract 8 and 7, 1 pa rin yung difference. So, linear function pa rin. Ibig sabihin, merong pattern. Ano yung, naging, ano yung pattern natin? Pattern natin is we are adding 2 to the value of x. So, how do we write that? The function is now, er, let me erase the common difference. So, we're done with that. So, what now is the function? The function is y equals x, kung ano man yung value ng x, plus the constant, which is 2. Hindi na nababago yung 2. Eh, mga pwede naman ako dito mag times 3. Mga pwede naman ako dito uh, mag maglagay pa ng iba. Hindi. Kasi naghahanap tayo ng pattern sa bawat uh, value because may relationship yung value ng x to the value of y. So, this is our function or we can also write it as f of x equals x plus 2. How about the second one? Ayan. Number 2. May erase this. Ang ating... Okay. Ito, anong nangyayari? So, start na lang tayo sa 0 kasi medyo mahirap kapag ne may negative, ba? So, start tayo sa 0. Value ng x is 0. So, start tayo dito. The value of x is 0. And the value of y is 3. So, ano kaya yung pwede natin gawin kay 0 para maging 3? So, pwede tayo mag-add ng 3. Kapag ginamit natin yung pangalawa, yung 1 and 4, so if the value of x is 1 and the value of y is 4, ano pwede natin i-gawin kay 1 para maging 4? 
So, kung ginawa yung kanina ay plus 3, pwede rin tayo mag plus 3. So, that's equal to 4. So, ibig sabihin, we are adding... 3 to whatever the value of x is. Kung halimbawa, ayan, ayan uh, 2 equals negative 1 plus 3. So, this is also true because negative 1 plus 3 is really 2. So, ibig sabihin, ang pattern naman natin this time ay we are adding 3. So, ano kaya yung ating function? Correct. So, that's y equals x plus 3 or Kung gumamit na tayo ng f of x kanina, we can use g of x naman. g of x plus 3. Pwede naman f of x. Okay lang. How about number 3? Ayan. Um, let's start with 0. The value of x is 0 and... Uh, the value of y is also 0. So, wala tayo nang gagawin siya kasi they're equal. How about the next one? The value of y is 2 and the value of x is 2. Ano kaya yung pwede natin gawin kay 1 para maging 2? mag add tayo ng 1. So, kung mag add tayo dito ng 1, dapat dito mag add din tayo ng 1. So, hindi pwede. Hindi na pwede yung rule na mag add tayo ng 1 kasi mababago na, hindi na mapafollow yung sa, ano, sa ibang terms. Okay? So, anong pwedeng gawin? Pwede tayong mag, ano ba yung four fundamental operations? Addition, subtraction, multipl multiplication, and division. If we're going to subtract, kung magsusubtract tayo, it will become negative. So, hindi rin pwede. Uh, unless, negative yung number na ilalagay natin. So, if we're going to subtract negative 1, it will become 2 pero kapag nag-subtract tayo dito ng negative 1 hindi na siya magiging hindi na magiging 0 yung result so next tayo kay multiplication ano yung pwede nating gawin kay 2 para maging ay kay 1 para maging 2 we can multiply so let's use this operation instead er, si, this symbol instead so kapag nag-multiply ako ng 2 at pag nag-multiply ako ng 2 dito 0 times 2 is also 0. So, it's possible. 2 times 1 is 2. So, correct. Okay? Try natin dun sa pangatlo. 2 equals... Ay, sorry. 4 pala. 4 equals 2. For if I will multiply it by 2, then this is also correct. As well with this. And negative 2 equals negative 1 times 2 is still negative 2. So, tama pa rin. Kasi, ibig sabihin, ang ating function is y equals x times 2, the value of x times 2, or 2x. So, pwede natin isulat as h of x equals 2x. Okay? Since ito, this is not a linear function, uh, alamin natin, ano kaya nangyayari dito? Bakit nagiging ganito? Bakit kaya naging 1 fourth, naging 1 half, naging 1, naging 2? Bakit kaya naging ganyan? So, ano yung relationship ng x sa y? Ayan. Um, ano nga to? So, start tayo sa 0. Tapos, y is 1. So, ano kayo pwede nating uh, gawin? K0 para maging 1. So, pwede tayo mag-add ng 1. Diba? So, add tayo ng 1. Ito naman, um, ang y natin ay 2, ang x natin ay 1. Kung mag-add tayo ng 1, this is also correct. Pero, pagdating dito, two, 4 and 2. Pag nag-add ako ng 1, hindi na siya i-equal sa 4. This is equal to 3. So, there's something wrong with the pattern. So, hindi siya addition of 1. So, mali. Balik. Okay. Ano kaya pwede natin gawin kay 2 para maging 4? Multiply tayo ng 2. Pag nag-multiply tayo ng 2, 0 times 2 is not equal to 1. 1 times 2 is equal to 2. 2 times 2 is equal to 4. So, dito lang nag-correct. Dito, hindi siya nag-correct. 
So, may mali. Diba? So, mali pa rin. Mali yun times 2. So, ibig sabihin, hindi talaga siya linear function. Kasi, yung pagta times 2, yung pagta times, sanbawa 3, pag-a-add, hindi, hindi applicable sa lahat ng ordered pairs. So, magiging ganito yung answer natin. It will become 2 raised to 1, 2 raised to 2, and 2 raised to 0. 2 raised to, ito yung, ito yung x, ito yung x, ito yung x, yung 0, 1, 2. 2 raised to 0 is equal to 1, 2 raised to 1 is equal to 2, 2 raised to 2 is equal to 4. If, and if we're going to get uh, 2 raised to negative 1, that is equal to, actually equal to 1 half. So, the function here is y equals 2 raised to x, wherein this is not a linear function. Kasi ang exponent mo ay x. Okay? So, that's how you um, look for the linear function using table of values. Okay? So, that's all.